good afternoon. We are at Marpo stall in Imtex and we would uh, be talking with Mr. Marco. Please explain about gear, uh, about transmission line product which are from Marpo. Good morning everyone. Uh, my name is Marco Curina and I'm uh, coming from Marpo's headquarter in Italy. So I'm joining uh, the Imtex exhibition this year to support my Indian colleagues uh, to uh, promote our solution also for the transmission market. Since I am uh, managing and I'm the responsible for all for what concerns the transmission solution that Marpos can propose all over the world. So what we thought it could be a good opportunity for us was to bring the M62 flex gauge to this exhibition because we believe it could be a very o great opportunity for gear and car manufacturer also in India. So this is a very simple gauge that I can show you in a few steps. This is a, a manual side gauge that can be used as a, an interoperational check for checking three main parameters of a gear, which are the overball dimension, the major and the root diameter. So it, it is a quite simple gauge for manual check so the operator can load the gear on a gauge and then uh, following the guided sequence can make the measurement so let me show you in a few steps how this gauge is working so the first step is to get next to the gauge then with a very simple operation we can apply the measurements then rotate and apply the measurements again then third part and that's it so in three very simple easy and quick operation you can check these three parameters on a gear this is a quite flexible unit because it can inspect a big variety of parts so from 30 millimeters diameter to 180 millimeters diameter so it, it is a very good opportunity for a customer a Marpos customer who is producing gears thank you very much for Margo explaining about this and now we will be going ahead with uh, more product range good afternoon we are at Marpos stall and we are talking to Mr. Mon please let me know about this machine which is here OptoFlash S30. Okay, let me start with a short presentation of myself. Good morning to everybody. I'm Simone Scortichini from Marpo Set Quartain in Italy. I'm the project manager of uh, Flexible Line uh, application, and today I'm going to introduce the lastest application we added in the Opto family. This is the uh, smallest unit uh, that we produce for optical inspection. Optical inspection means uh, a flexible solution to measure shaft in very precise way using the shadow casting technology. So basically the system is able to uh, acquire the shadow that uh, we uh, produce with the light on the side of the bench. Uh, the smallest bench has been designed for a very sh a small shaft like a medical implant, turbo shaft, uh, cam shaft for motorbikes, and uh, the solution is based on a 2D camera this gives us many advantages in terms of precision, uh, stability of the measurement because we don't need to move the part. As you can see uh, inside the bench, uh, we don't have any carrier that move the sensor up and down along the axis of the, the part. And uh, we can uh, keep uh, uh, the measure stable during the time because uh, we are able to reduce the maintenance time. The system is very, very precise. You can think that with the new technology of the 2D camera, we can reach uncertainty of measurement of uh, one micron for diameter and two micron for the length. So the system is very, very uh, reliable and the performance that we can achieve with this new technology is very, very important for automotive industry, medical, and also for the aerospace where we need to test very small shafts. Well, coming to OptoQuick M60, Simon will give us more idea about this machine. Yes, this machine has been designed to test part 
bigger than uh, what you can test in the OptoFlash. Uh, we can uh, test the gear shaft, camshaft, crankshaft uh, with a length that for the M60 can be up to 600 millimeter, but the family is quite huge. So we have uh, M19 and the L version. L version means large. Uh, in the large version, we have M60, L60, sorry, L19 and XXL, that means extra large, where we can test uh, uh, camshaft and crankshaft for truck and uh, uh, for tractor. So there we need to challenge with the biggest part and with part that has a, a weight either than the standard one. Uh, the technology is a little bit different compared with the OptoFlash because we use a 1ccd uh, monoarray sensor so we need to scan the part uh, along the axis. Uh, in any case uh, also with this solution we can reach very high performance in terms of cycle times because the axis can scan the part quickly so the cycle times at the end for the production is very very low. Uh, bench can be used uh, both in a shop floor application with manual loading operation or with automatic loading uh, done by a robot or a gantry or can be used in the lab. Uh, the uh, design of this bench is very very strong you can see the open wide area where you can load in very ergonomic condition the EV part or you can introduce a robot without any modification to the bench because we can handle signal exchange uh, with external environment and you can uh, uh, use this equipment in the uh, shop floor with automatic loading application. It's not only optical, this device, because uh, during the uh, year gain more experience with our customer, we have decided to extend the flexibility of the machine. So uh, now the scalability of the product gives you the chance to add different sensors. So we have uh, optical uh, snap, that is the core of the machine, but we can add G25, that is a touching probe made by Marpos, or you have the cam follower, the axial contact. All these probes can extend the flexibility of the machine and perform different kind of measurement that is not possible with, uh, with the optical snap. Thank you, Mr. Simon, for your valuable information. We wish all the best for this particular show. Yeah, thanks.